Hi, I'm Kieran. I'm a Cisco Networking Academy student at RNC. It's brilliant to have this opportunity to work with one of the biggest companies in the world because the opportunities are endless. So after here, I hope to go on to an apprenticeship or a traineeship somewhere to kind of further my knowledge. And today, I'm going to be showing you how to change the host name of a switch. So um, I'm going to be using accessible software, so I'll be using JAWS screen reader. So I'm just going to go and log into the shift. RNC1981 backslash FO I'm going to be using is TerraTerm, and that's just an application that eliminates the terminal, so it allows me to access the switches and the routers and configure them. And so what I'm going to need to do to connect the PC to the switch is to take a network cable and put it in the patch panel at the back of the rack. It basically patches it through to this PC and then connect it to the console port on the switch which just allows me to configure it and access it as if it was an administrator. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is go ahead and open the TerraTerm application, which is the application that allows me to access the switches and the routers and configure those. TerraTerm. Enter. TerraTerm dash left bracket disconnected right bracket VT. TerraTerm colon new connection dialog. So I'm going to get to one of the levels now by typing enable. E -A 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 -A. E -A -A -A. And just pressing enter. Enter, LL underline, LAN number. So the character at the end of the line shows that I've changed modes, so it went from a greater than symbol to a number sign or a hashtag symbol. Now to get into the configuration mode where I need to be, I can type conf t, because it is actually a configure terminal, but you can shorten commands. So I've just changed the host name on a switch and that's just one of the many things that I've learned to do at the Cisco Network Academy at RNC. Um, it's a brilliant thing. It's, I'm privileged to be able to do this because I'm one of only six students studying this with a visually impaired element in Europe. And it's just brilliant to know that this will open up so many opportunities in the future because at RNC I can network.